Welcome to our tutorial on views. I'm going to undock the Quick View toolbar. Just one click on mouse button number one, move it, and hold shift. We already know about the isometric view, the front view, back view, and so on. The last function is called named views. You can also access named views under the View drop down menu. I'm going to reorient the solid and now I will press the Add button. Now I'm going to name this view and click Apply. Let's check to make sure it works. I'm going to click Isometric View and click Apply. Now I click My View and click Apply. We see that it did take effect. Now, if I want to modify My View, I reorient it as required. Click Modify, then Apply. Let's check it again. If we want to check how this looks from the back, we can click Reverse. I click Reverse. Let's close this window. Another function I want to show here is the Look At function. You can get it from the Views drop down menu Modify, Look At. Now I press mouse button 1. I drag it, and when I change orientation, the camera position changes. When I release mouse button 1, the view repositions. Let's click Fit All In, and let's try it again. Release mouse button 1, and we have Look at View. Click Fit All In. If you have a different license and don't have this option, what you can do is hold down the Shift key and uh, your mouse button too. Move it a little, change directions, and when you release, you'll have the look at view. Okay, let's try it again. Shift, mouse button 2. And this concludes our views tutorial.